What's up? So excited about this one. It's my favorite listing of the month, potentially the year. The year's still young, though. This is a cool house. When I pulled up, I'm like, yep, this is the so best house. Cul de sac in central Boca, one of the best locations you can get. You're like sandwiched between all the major arteries, right? So you have Turnpike to your west, 95 to the east, and then you have Glades to the north and what, Palmetto to the south. So no matter where you're going, you're going to get there quick, right? Yeah. Who's this guy? This is the homeowner. How's it going? <laughs> Not weird at all. <laughs> all right, you gonna take us inside? Yes, please come. So we have two car garage. You can see the curb appeal right out of the gate. I love this private location in the cul-de-sac. Nobody's coming down this street unless you live here. Another thing I noticed that the HOA is not on top of you to stop you from putting the mailbox you want, even the type of roof that you want. I've seen some with shingles and other different styles, so that's cool. But for now, let me show you this amazing property. It's a three bedroom with a den plus two bathroom. You can see vaulted ceilings. So you don't have any popcorn in here. You have a nice open design floor plan and it's so inviting with these wood floors. And we sell a lot of houses. The uniqueness and charm of these floors, I love it. Yeah, so this is your living space. You have different places you can relax, read a book, have a coffee or another type of beverage if you so prefer. <laughs> and you're still part of somebody's in the kitchen trying to prepare a meal. You're still part of that, but you have a little bit of separation with this Half wall. Well, who's this? Half. This is Josh. <laughs> Come on with me. So we have a stacked bedroom plan. You have room for an exercise room if you don't need all bedrooms in this house. And everything is done just super clean and to perfection. You have some crown molding going on here. If you look at the bathroom, it's completely finished, really tastefully done. So this is another bedroom. Mm -hmm. See the modern fixtures on the doors, the door handles, things like that are modern, including the lighting. They kept it bright and light, and you can see the crown molding continues in this room as well. Here we go into the primary bedroom. Sweet, has vaulted ceilings, also two windows for extra lighting. Yeah, I love it. It's like a, uh, it feels like you're in a cottage, like you're yes. not in Florida. Mm -hmm. Everything from the floors to the vaulted ceilings, the double windows on either side of the bed, and the closet. Show us the closet. Yes closet very important so you got a full walk-in closet that's built out with shelving california closet and even a lot of space for your shoes too primary bath with um, access to the backyard so you don't have to trek through the whole house got a nice shower but everything you need in here plenty of space for two people okay cool show us the other side of that yes let's do it also there's a nice thermostat or a little extra oomph a little extra oomph. Oom. This is where all the magic happens in the kitchen. Magic. Well, Stephen just got taller. Magic. So the kitchen is a step up. It's a step up. It's a concrete slab kitchen. Very unique to this property. And you know, cook overseas the rest of the family. I kind of like it. And what I notice here, these bar stools are on the interior yes. of the kitchen when it's usually on the exterior. And that's very smart because it, it keeps this hallway open and it allows for extra cabinet space. So they really maximize the storage in this space, in this room. Magic. And it also made room for a what? My favorite wine cooler. Fits perfectly in this little niche. So the owners, we did this kitchen a few years ago put in all new appliances and just made it much more beautiful than it was previously. What room is Steven in? So Steven is huh? in the hallway that leads to the garage. This used to be... I thought you were going to say the closet. <laughs> Steven's in the You're closet. in the closet. <laughs> that, that might be true. That, that, that's, that's... Okay, so that used to be the laundry room and now... Yes, there used to be the laundry room. The hookups are still there. The, now it's extra storage space, which I think is a brilliant idea. So you can have like a new pantry here or you can use it for shoes too. You know, whatever extra shoes, if that's your thing. That's your thing. And then... So all the shelving, I think it's perfectly perfect fit for this space. Right. And then this leads into the two-car garage. So you got hurricane rated garage door. You can see yes. these braces. Yes, brand new front door, hurricane rated garage door. The whole house has hurricane protection and the roof is less than two years old. That's a biggie. So right off the dining room, I saw a little cool room. Yes, come see it. This will be my favorite room for me to do some work. Oh, did you lock it? You lock it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I want to see you. I want to see you struggle. I like seeing you struggle with doors. Oh, you're so mean. 
Don't do that. <laughs> Cue the piano right. music. <laughs> We're gonna start the timer again. Oh. Starting now. I don't want to break it, Chris. No, just do it. I, I have faith in you. You can open the door. No, I don't want it. You better hurry up. I only have three more minutes. Hey. I knew you could do it. Thanks, Chris. This would be my favorite room if I was to work from home because it's close to the kitchen. Well, it's also close to the wine cooler. That could be dangerous. But it's close to the kitchen, it's away from the rest of the house. So if you have kids on that side of the house, you still have great space to work this in. This is a really cool little space. It is. And look, you can even access the backyard from here, which we have to see. So you got double doors to a backyard paradise. Now this is... Joshua. That's Joshua. That's my favorite part out here. Josh? No. Well, Josh is awesome, but this patio and this backyard, it's so quiet and so private. And I believe this is probably the most private lot on this street. And, and, and it's facing the lake. <laughs> you get all giddy with that lake. I am. Plenty of room for a pool. If that's, that's what you want, you have plenty of room to put one in. If not, you can enjoy a swing here. There's a swing over there. There are so many butterfly plants and butterflies. There is over a hundred palm trees on this property. There are mango, papaya, and avocado trees here as well that are all mature, though so you'll have your own fruit. This path leads to a walking trail. And by the way, there's two other paths on this property that lead to the, the kind of wrap around the house that are paved. This little path is like a little hidden gem. It leads to a almost one mile path around a lake. And, and, and the lake has an island that's so much fun for the kids to explore. And here is this hidden gem that you would just never know if you just came down with your car in the street and you see people with their strollers, bike families, kids playing. You can take a kayak and you can paddle out to a little fun island in the middle of the lake and you can just have really good family time out here. And so if people want to have family time out here and they want to see this place, please call me, text me. We're also doing an amazing open house this coming weekend. I'm friendly. You can tell how excited I am there about this are. listing. So in the last video, Walton did a happy hop. <laughs> Jen is dancing. Yeah, Anything? you just get me. <laughs> yeah, I, can't even, I can't even try to crowbar you into something. Yeah, no, you get. No, me. that's it. You get. That's okay. You get, which which you is more than enough. Accent, which goes through all my videos, and I can't help it. <laughs> I love it. All right, with that, that wraps up our tour. Give this woman yes. a call. And if you're selling too, give her a call too. She'll love to sell your house. I'm we'll friendly. To, if she's friendly, we'll love to show it. And if you watch this on YouTube, please hit that subscribe button so we keep doing these really cool vlog tours. Thank you for watching. Adios.